Hey there, everyone. This is Zach Alplin, Dog Game, and today is gonna be Boss Town. That's right. We're gonna fight a boss. It's the same one as last time. I mean, the name is the same, but they added the two. Zero out of zero. Health is already empty. We did it. We won. All right, right here in the middle of the park. You must have taken a wrong turn. There's Corona again. Osboom, I have the puppy trapped. This new vehicle of yours had better work. It's a boat. I'm not there by sleep. It's my best invention ever. It's a boat with a... We have to figure out some way to stop Cruella. In fact... I mean, isn't this hey, what you want? Maybe we can want? use his mallets. Man, your voice crack. Woof. No, all right. Pop like that. All right. Yeah, there we go. Hey. Oh, I hate melon. By causing damage to her, she uh, got an actual health bar. That's nice. That's how it works. All right, I missed, but that's okay. It's a magic melon that comes back. It's all right. Well, why'd you bring it to the park where you'd be riding on a boat? Like, you're gonna get it wet regardless. And that's just kind of foolish on your end. I, there it sounded like she was on fire. So, you know, not recommended. Alright. I didn't. I did it. Oh boy. Uh, that's a flip. So that happened very quickly. I. <laughs> that was. Some would say, a boss fight. <laughs> that felt easier than the first one. But you do have to aim more Whoa, better, good. Totally like, manually. Fun. Yeah, I bet Corolla will spend a week getting seeds out of her hair. I would like to ride a yeah. watermelon. <laughs> well, I guess we better get going. Hey, Mom and Dad should be close. Let's try to catch up with them. Okay, let's go. No, I'm riding this melon instead. That's how I'm passing Those my days. Oh, jeez. My beautiful clothes. <laughs> Ruined. <laughs> oh, don't take it so hard, Mr. Bill. It's not all your fault. Of course not, you imbecile. You incompetent goats are entirely to blame. And Le Pen, I expected so much more from you. It's a boat. A bit of oh, bad him. Luck, madame. Yeah, he just got locked up. Have no fear. I, Le Pelt, will deal with these pesky puppies to sweet. Then why are you standing there like a village idiot? I will not tolerate any more failure. Now get out of my sight, all of you! Oh, that melon is sticky. Fosboom, my dot com darling, do you have any good news? It's kind of yes, moving right on, huh? Cruella, the superglue formula is complete. As soon as your army of robotic toys return to the factory with all the captured pets, we can begin the dipping process. And then, with the pets frozen in shiny shells of superglue, we shall sell them throughout England as my new line of perfectly realistic animal toys. <laughs> <laughs> There's something about that cut. Oh, okay. And next time we're back in the cut, which, which that makes sense in terms of getting to where we're trying to get. Oh boy. Yeah, no cutscenes though. We're, we're just here. Yeah, please exit. I'm gonna resave just in case. You know, get go from 50 to 50. We did it. Alright, so, yeah, that was kind of a non-event, but you know what, that's fine. Like I said, I think that the real challenge that this time you have to, like, actually aim your things, and, you know, if you're not used to video games. We did not unlock a... a thing, though, right? No, we do. We got checkers, which we did not used to have, I'm pretty sure. I didn't notice that. But anyway, last time I played mini golf, let's play Dig Dug, which is a real game. You need to just kind of look snub. That's how you win. No, you gotta inflate a dragon. Yeah, give me instructions. 
Bird. Hello. Hi. Dogs have been burying all kinds of crazy things in this backyard for no, years and no, years. No kidding. Oddball and Domino like to play a game of concentration back here. They oh. call the game Dig Dog. The goal of Dig Dog but it's is to pick up matching items like horseshoes and bones and other stuff Got like it. that. You could to dig, you run yep. over to a pile of dirt and press the action button. See, uh, After a bit yep. of quick digging, that's a bird. Object will be revealed. Look at that animation Next, loop. You run to another pile his of dirt, feet aren't connected to his legs. Item. If the items they put are a dog collar on it. Placed with flowers, your score is increased, and you get to take another turn. Ooh, if the ooh. items do not match, they are replaced in their dirt piles. Wow. The most important part of Dig Dog is remembering where items are buried, no so that you kidding. can match them up as quickly as possible. See, I wish that this game is slightly different. I would the have locations the option the of beginning. getting either, like you know, like just like give me the the one set. And in summary, and not this whole thing, where he goes into depths into the nuances of what is the game of concentration. No kid, wow, really? You play the game serially? Whoa, wowie! Well, that's about it. Yeah. You can't tell me what to do. I have one player. Okay, so we're playing for time. Oh, except it's like on a big map. So that makes it a bit more complicated. Oh, except it's not. All right. I'm digging. All right, horseshoe. Horseshoe. No, it's a bull. Don't match. All right. Uh, there's a butterfly. And there's the ball. Oh, man. All right. So here's the ball. And that's a butterfly. I'm wrong. Groovy. All the kids say that. There's the butterfly. And here's the butterfly. I found that. Underneath me is a horseshoe. And here's a balloon that we managed to bury underground. Here's a whole house we buried underground. Don't worry about it. Here's a bone. You gotta have a bone. That's a duck. Ducks do not have bones, according to that sign. Horseshoe is all the way here on the other side of the map. Wow! I know, right? Alright, here's the bowl, also on the other side of the map. Alright, that's the sound you play. Yes! I'm still going in pure serially. There's a house we buried gingerly. Oh no, it's over here. This is the house, right? This is the house. Putting down the house here, right? And my memory isn't isn't what it could. Yeehaw though! And tap that button. There's a bone. The bone is here. Whoa! Welcome to Bone Zone. Wow. That is not what Oddball said. She did not say welcome to Bone Zone. Yeah. Remember when I was like, ha ha, bearing a balloon. That's funny. But it's not funny anymore now, is it? There you go. There's a quack. And there's a duck. Boneless duck. Great for lunch. A dead a dance. If you can dance like that, you dance like a dog. I don't know that. Whoa, I read that as internal only. I don't know how I did that. Why though? Ah, uh, you don't need to save. I guess we'll save. Gotta save my score. What if it adds a percent? It didn't. How do I get out of here? Um. Okay, you gotta press start, and that's how we act. Okay, weird. So you gotta uh, summon forth your menu while you are in a menu. That feels weird and bad. Well, honestly, let's keep going, I guess. That was mini god. We played Dig Dug. See, we got Rafuf and a Y. Let's play Tilt Maze. Let's tilt that maze. Gonna say that maze to tilt it. Tilt it! You know, point at it aggressively. All right, talk to me at length. Hi. This Hi. is the tilt maze game. Whoa, your voice As is you cracking, left, Frankie Muniz. Right, up and down. You tilt the board, and that makes the ball roll. The more you tilt the board, the faster the ball will roll. Okay. If you tilt the board just a little bit, mm -hmm. the ball will move slowly, and you have lots more control. I guess you can. Your skip. goal is to roll the ball through the maze all the way to the finish line. Yeah, it's one of those like if wooden you toys. Hole, you don't lose the game. But it's not you wooden. You start over at the beginning. It's digital. The top score is saved along with your game. Wow. Good luck. See, short and sweet. Just telling me what to do. 
Oh boy, okay, so, okay, so. So, it, uh, 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 yeah, that's, so that's gonna be my commentary here. This feels weird, but playable, most, so yeah, I don't know if you can skip there. I'm not, I mean, I probably shouldn't go for speed strats, like, when I just started. Do you think this is based off of, like, an actual, like, product you could buy? Look at that, I'm gonna go for the, yeah, the squeeze, but right into the hole. But my time is reset, so, okay. This is neat, though. I, as a kid, I love these things. I was never good at them, but I love them. Uh... It's not exactly the same playing a digital one, like, that's not gonna be a shocker, I'm sure, because I feel like I'm never really sure, like, how tilted I am. I mean, I have a general idea, but... Yeah, no, yeah. There's a certain tactile feeling that is missing that would make a lot a big difference that you don't have which I mean you know of course you don't have it but I'm still gonna mention it oh. okay I can just let it sink here just, ah, okay right and this is where I died last time calling it death so it's a game about dogs and that is what dogs know god damn it dude Dude, really? Dude, no, Jamal. That's the way to do it. Subtle movements. I guess maybe that was my mistake. I was going to extremes. I believe it. Uh, 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 ooh, that was pretty nice though. Alright, so we can sink here to go here. Not. So I like. Yeah, go forcefully down. That's fine. Okay, here less so. Here's like the hard part. There's always like a really hard part. Okay. Okay, here we get a bunch of let in the corner. No, ooh, okay, see, this, okay. How, I, I have no feel for, like, how straight my board is. Okay, so, nuance, 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 no, 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 too fast, too fast. Yeah, I'm not gonna do it in part-time. I'm okay with that, I'm okay with that. Not that far off, though, right? Well, I got a clown horn. That's pretty good. No. That's pretty good, though. Alright, yeah, save that thing. It's fine. Okay, no, that's pretty cool. Like, again, like, it, it, it does not, like, touch, like, what a reel would be, but, like, I think it's neat. But, I, uh, there's a certain tack, tackness to it. That's not the word, uh, that I'm missing that, oh, did I, get, I got the best time. Alright, forget about it then. It's cool. So I got only checkers? Might as well check it out. Yeah, let's... I mean, like, what... That looks like just like a regular checkered board. Uh, let's find out what that's about. You put the red thing, then you put another guy. Alright. Hello. Teach me it's about checker. inventor Rodney Farsboom here. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Please don't make fun of my name. Now, the rules of this checkers game are as follows. Each player has a group of checkers. One side is red, and the other is black. Wow. Luella prefers black because it goes so well with her hair. If you can hop over your opponent's checker, the piece is removed from the game. To pick the checker you want to move, run your character over to it and press the action button. Then... Run your character to the square you wanted to move to and press the action button again. If you can move one of your checkers all the way to the opposite end of the board, it automatically becomes a king checker. K 
king Normally is it called a queen? Special, because they can move forward hmm. or backward. Wow. You win the game by taking all of your opponent's checkers. Total annihilation your opponent only. opponent can't move any checkers. That's it. You can play now, but again, please don't make fun of my name. Very sensitive. Thank you, Professor Frank. Oh, no, yeah. Let's play a fish. Look, look, buddy. I'm not playing. Let's play the medium. I'm not playing the game of checkers to play by some garbage kitchen rules, alright? By the way, I do not really know how to play checkers. Um. Like, I know the rules, but, like, I'm gonna be real, so I have to kill, which means, yeah, see, uh, if I try to do that, oh, it doesn't even tell me, it just, I can't. So, yeah, I've fallen for, like, a trap, and then it's gonna kill two, and then I'm gonna kill you, and then uh, it is incentivized to do that to do that again. Because I don't have a choice, you're gonna murder that, and then what happens? If I go there, you have to kill it, and then I get to kill it. Oh boy, murder in the house. So I feel like that's what Checker is all about, is everyone has to murder. I might as well... Sacrifice one to be destroyed once again. Here we go. Truly, life is cruel in the world of chickens. I don't know what I want here. I'm going to move you here. Is that smart? I have no clue. So what's the correct move there? Like, I'm not sure. I genuinely do not know. If I move there, you have to kill it. You can't kill and then I can kill, so maybe I'll do that. You have to. You don't have a choice. Your bloodlust is overwhelming. Like, we are, I have five, you have five, you know, it's pretty equal. So I think the strat here is I'm gonna put you here. If I put you here, you have to kill... If I put you here, you have to kill, I can kill, and you're de-emphasized from moving that one, but maybe you will anyways. If I do that, you're emphasized, you have to kill, you go here, and like, that's no good. If I move you here, you can't do anything about it. If you want to protect it, you have to go here, then I can kill it. Sure, let's do that. Okay, and then I have to destroy, and I will do that. There we go. Uh-huh. So, do not move him ever until he who's him. Understood. I'm gonna move him here to de-emphasize you from moving him ever. Alright, so I have to perform the sordid act, and so I will. But then you ha- oh! I messed that one up. Alright, well I have to do this here. So you might get yourself a queen soon, but I'm on my way to queen them too. Alright, I guess I'll move you to be annoying. Wahoo! Wahoo. Like, we're kinda... Oh, shoot. Um... Cancel. Like, I don't want you to, like, combo. Like, yeah, you're gonna destroy that one. But who cares? Like, I got a queen too. And I can murder too. But my queen has a buddy! And I might have two. Okay, I cannot move you up there because you're gonna chomp chomp. But what I can do is be sad. Yeah, let's do that. See, my goal here is I want to have two royals. 
and I have accomplished that goal. All right, wahoo. That's what they say. All right, so I don't know what you do once the game reaches this state. Yeah. Um. All right, well, let's try and corner him, I guess. Just don't do anything stupid. See, if I bring you down here, you eat it, you're up there, that's no good for anyone. Here, yeah, your incentivized to go down. If I do that, you go here. If I move you there, I'm dead. I can move you here, though, to limit your movements. I can go here, which means, uh... If I move you here, no, mm, no. Yeah, you can go there. Then I can go here. Yeah, this got real stupid, didn't it? Right, I'm gonna go here. And you, I'm gonna put you here, so you can't go there. Then I'm gonna put you here, so... Well, that was silly. Then I can go here, forcing you to retreat. If I go there, you're just gonna return exactly where you were. This is... This sucks. <laughs> um... Like, we're just gonna go around in circles forever. I don't know, I guess I can go here. I don't know what to do. Like, I'm basically waiting for you to make a mistake, but... Are you gonna make a mistake? I don't know, man. This seems unwinnable. What happens if I do this? Because you can't eat it, so you're gonna go there. If- oh, 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 so what I do is I put you here so you have to eat it, but you can't eat me, and then I devour you. Okay, right here. There you go. Regicide leads to regicide. Okay, I did it! Look at that. Video games. And sometimes analog games. You don't save a goal, so I don't have a choice of saving. All right, and that's all mini- we caught up with mini games. Good. So there's gonna be two more that we're gonna be- so I'm assuming two more bosses, Ice Race and Jam Dance. Sounds sticky. I don't know. I, I wouldn't put a dog in a bunch of jam, pers personally. I'm not judging.